This has been a very special project. We've partnered with the amazing Kangan Institute and Bendigo TAFE to create our very own fully accessible sensory garden. A sensory garden that's been designed to touch, smell and taste. Even though you're blind, you can still garden actually. If anything, it's more of an incentive to have some plants around you, even if they're in pots. It just makes you feel a lot better. There's been a lot of people around to guide you through. I loved the braille. I'm learning braille at the moment, so it was good to be able to have a practice. Everything's been uh, quite smelly in a good way, and I've been able to touch everything, so I love that. Guide dogs have led our students down pathways that we could never have thought of. There's 40 students that have never built one of these things before and they managed to pull this off and it looks fantastic. Over the course of this show, thousands of visitors joined guide dog staff and volunteers to experience the sensory garden. It's a really wonderful atmosphere and um, yeah, it's just a great day to be alive in Melbourne <laughs> at the garden show. <laughs>